Welcome to AI and Marketing. I am your host and news curator, Stan Bertolo from Nitro Marketing. You will find links to all the stories mentioned in this episode in the show notes. Today is October 29th, 2024. Here is what we are covering. Elon Musk's takeover of Twitter two years ago has resulted in significant losses, with the company's value dropping by 80%. Despite this, Musk remains unbothered due to his immense wealth and the platform's shift into a political project supporting Donald Trump. As Musk engages in controversial activities like promoting posts alleging election interference and questionable voter outreach efforts, legal challenges arise, such as a recent accusation of running an illegal lottery scheme in Philadelphia. Meanwhile, other tech leaders like Tim Cook and Mark Zuckerberg are carefully navigating political affiliations, choosing to remain non-committal as they assess potential risks under a Trump administration. Shifting gears from Musk's tumultuous Twitter acquisition to the evolving role of AI in business, Gartner predicts that AI agents will soon transform the workplace, enabling enterprises to automate and augment human talents significantly. However, there is growing disillusionment as generative AI slides into the trough of disillusionment due to unmet high expectations and underestimated implementation costs. Despite this, AI remains crucial, with a rising number of enterprises integrating it into areas like IT, security, and marketing to enhance productivity. Gartner forecasts that by the mid-2020s, a significant portion of enterprises will adopt AI-augmented strategies and responsible AI governance programs. In the realm of AI innovation, Google is rolling out an AI-powered Help Me Write feature for Gmail users on the web, using Gemini AI to assist in crafting and editing emails. The tool, previously available on mobile, requires a subscription to Google One AI Premium or the Gemini add-on for Workspace. It offers capabilities such as generating drafts, providing suggestions to formalize, elaborate, or shorten messages, and includes a new Polish shortcut for refining emails with over 12 words. This enhancement will gradually become available, aiming to streamline email composition for subscribers. Switching our focus to the media world, in a recent controversy, Jeff Bezos's decision against having the The Washington Post endorse Kamala Harris has led to over 200,000 cancelled subscriptions, amount to about 8% of its subscriber base. This backlash seems to be connected to perceptions of Bezos attempting to foster relations with Donald Trump, with notable timing as executives from his company, Blue Origin, met with Trump the same day of the non-endorsement announcement. Despite Bezos's claims of a principled decision and assurances of no ulterior motives related to his business interests, critics argue this action potentially undermines the trust in the media and could reflect broader pressures around his multiple business ventures. This development underscores concerns about potential conflicts of interest arising from Bezos's expansive business portfolio. Finally, we move from the impact of business decisions on public perception to the scientific exploration of personal spaces, as research shows that clutter can significantly impact stress levels by limiting focus and the brain's ability to process information leading to increased irritability and decreased productivity. A study from Princeton University highlights how an organized, clutter-free environment can enhance cognitive performance, while UCLA's research links cluttered homes to elevated stress hormone levels, particularly in women. Cleaning up clutter not only saves time and money, but also improves mood and self-esteem, with organized environments fostering positive behaviors, such as increased generosity and healthier choices, as demonstrated by a psychological science study. Experts suggest starting with small, manageable decluttering projects and maintaining habits like sorting mail immediately to sustain a tidy space. Thank you for tuning in to AI and Marketing. If you want to learn more, check out the episode description. Be sure to subscribe on your favorite podcast platform so you never miss an episode. Contact us to learn how to launch your own AI-generated podcast at nitromarketing.com. That's N-Y-T-R-O marketing.com. See you tomorrow for more AI and tech news.